hi guys you welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to show you how to make tiger nut milk tiger nut milk is gotten from tiger nuts it is a very natural juice that can be taken anytime anywhere and anyhow you can prepare this tiger nut milk and store it in the house for the family it's so nutritious and very good for the body this tiger nut milk does not contain sugar and so you don't need sugar in preparing it except you so wish keep watching as i'm going to show you all the ingredients that you can use in order to prepare this tiger nut milk this is tiger nut a very fresh tiger nut though it is dried i like using dry tiger nuts because it contains a lot of milk this is what i'm going to use to prepare this tiger nut milk i'm going to wash this tiger nut thoroughly so that there will be no sand particles in it and then soak it for three days after three days i'll be right back i'm going to add water and start washing the tiger nut You know, this tiger nut has stayed so long, and so that is the reason we have to wash it thoroughly, so that there will be no sand particles in it. I'm going to add another water and wash it. This is how I'm going to wash it until I wash it four times so that it will be very clean. After soaking the tiger nut for three days, this is how it looks like. Meanwhile, you have to change the water every day. And this is the fresh one. I have also soaked it for three days. I keep changing the water each day. These are other ingredients that I'm going to add to this tiger nut. This is coconut. Make sure you use dry coconut. And here I have dates. Dates is very nutritious and it's milky. So we have to add all these things together and grind it. Meanwhile, I'm going to rinse this out from the water. You have to wash this date two to three times before peeling it. Don't forget to remove the seed from this date before you grind it. After washing everything to satisfaction, I'm going to add it to the washed tiger nut. This is the coconut that I have broken. You have to cut it to pieces just like this. This is the one that I've not cut. In case you're wondering how to cut it, this is how you cut it. And this is the date. I have removed all the seeds from it. This is the seeds. This one is no more useful and so we are going to throw it away. Or you plant it if you so wish. After adding everything together, you have to add ginger. As it is now, it is set for blending. So I'm going to blend it. Remember, you have to blend it thoroughly so that it will have a very smooth texture. After blending it nicely, you can see how it is. It becomes like a paste. So we are going to add water and sieve it. After adding water, you have to turn it so that it will mix. I have to use cloth in order to sieve it so that there will be no particles in it. 
You can see the milk coming out. Very thick. This is natural. We have to add it little by little until it is exhausted. You have to hold the edges of the cloth and tighten it so that the milk will come out very well. After saving it, we have to turn out the shafts and add more. This is the after wash of the tiger nut. This one as it is, is still milky. So I'm still going to add water and rinse it out. After sieving everything nicely, I'm going to sieve it the second time. The reason why we are sieving it the second time is so that if there was any particle, it will be out. This is the leftover shaft. I'm going to throw it away. Make sure you don't add this to your tiger nut milk so that there will be no particles in it. This is the afterwash of the tiger nut. You can see how it is. There is no more milk in it. So this one is no more useful and so we are going to throw it away. Or we give it to goats to eat it. After saving the tiger nut, this is the milk that we have. You can see it's very plenty and very thick. I'm going to test it. Hmm. Very sweet. Remember, we are not going to add sugar to it. But if you like sugar, you can add it a little. Because in as much as we have added the dates, the dates is a natural sweetener. And so we are not going to add sugar to it. We can only add some milk if you have, just for the flavor. So I'm going to add my milk. Very little. The tiger nut drink is ready. So I'm going to save. You can see how thick it is. Tiger nut milk is very easy and fast to prepare. You can prepare this and store it in the fridge for the family. This tiger nut milk is far better than mineral. Because mineral contains a lot of sugar. Whereas this tiger nut is natural. No preservative, no coloring, and no added sugar. So it is pure natural. If you love this video, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also share this video with your family and friends. See you in my next video. Bye.